So it is day four of harvest and we filled wagons last night in the dark uh, and we're going to move a couple wagons today. I worked for tractor a little bit this morning and now Chris has taken me to the back of the field to pick up the Kubota and that full wagon and take it in. And there's no clouds but for some reason there's a chance of rain today so we'll see. Hey Avery, our whole family is going to the elevator with corn. What do you think? Yeah. Who's driving that tractor up there? Yeah, and who's back behind us with another load? Uh, Uncle Chris and Trinity. Uncle Chris and Trinity? Yeah. yeah I better slow down. I'm going to run over Mama. <laughs> what do you think of all this? Yeah. It's pretty awesome? Yeah. Well, we're almost there. Luckily, we don't have to go far. Yeah. Lots of fun. First well, time. Else we would have to do rental. This is like an old school wagon train, huh? Yeah, we have to get buckles on. All right. We'll talk to you later. What's going on up there, Avery Jane? The corn is going down. The corn's going down, then where does it go? Into the drain. Into the drain? Yeah. And then where does it go? Does, does it go into those big tall towers out there? Yes. I think so. Either that or one of these big metal bins. Then go into those scenes and then, then go to the houses that 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 have tons. So, so yeah. Like, we don't until this is torn at all. That's that's pretty important that part that you said that it goes to a house that has corn because if it goes to a house that has beans Oh my goodness, then you would have beans mixed with corn. Would that be good? No. No, it is not good You should run this elevator. You'd be good at it What do you think? Could you run this elevator? Maybe uh, Maybe one day Well, I really want to be a bunny tower I think you could do both of those things. Pretty old bunny tail. <laughs> yeah. So that was kind of cool first thing, uh, first time that... And also I got a whole, also I got a pet, I got two pet last night and it was very fun. This one over Avery, and Avery got the pet spider last night, yeah. but tonight, this today, we all three took uh, wagons to the elevator. Uncle Chris, and me, and Sam is up there parking away. her wagon. How did Mama do taking her corn to the elevator? Yeah, but I was going slow. <laughs> yeah, that's okay. Yeah. That's okay if you go slow, especially on the first time. Yeah. Taking the wagon train. You did. What did you learn? You rode with Uncle Chris to the elevator. What did you learn? About like so. I saw my data so away because my data away. I learned about how the thing functions. How the tractor works? No. Oh, the elevator? Yeah. Oh, that's fine. We talked about the elevator too. Now it's time to fuel up. Clogged the head on the 1420. I was running it down on the ground trying to pick up some of this corn that was pushed down by hail and flood water and stuff like that. And I just thought since I was right here by, the, by this water hole, I would show you guys basically nothing out here. Uh, let me flip the camera around so you can see. There's just like some stocks here and it got down low and tried to pick stuff up. But there's just not a lot out here in this section. So 
So water puddles up right here when they got the heavy rains early in the year. Water puddles up right here and the wind kind of blows it over that direction towards the front of the property. But even though this looks really flat, there's kind of a ridge out there right about where the corn starts, where the good plant starts. And that ridge keeps the water from running back uh, down to the ditch by the road and out. So it just kind of puddles up here until it dries out. So uh, it killed off about an acre this year. And you get these little, some of them grew something, these little mini ears. Like that. So I'm going to unclog this head. And we've got one more past this. i got to go down to that end and then come back and I'll be done. So then we'll move over to another farm. I guess that wagon wasn't pulling up, they wanted to put some more in there, and the car was already parked there. And it's easier for me to dump in the car than it is a little wagon anyway, so we got a little double, double offloading party going on. Man, it is looking a little bit like rain clouds. We'll see what happens with that. So I like to get more drone videos, but we were going so fast today and getting so much done that I really just kept the combine running. And these are the last four rows. We, we finished everything at Maple Lawn and then came over to the Rust Farm. And these are the last four rows in the, in the front two cornfields of the Rust Farm. And I'll have to show an aerial video of those two fields uh, tomorrow with my drone. But uh, this is the end of it, so I think we're done for tonight, too. It's like 7.30 or 7.45. That's awesome.